Hi, it's me, Martine, here, talking from my studio. Showing you latest instruments I've done making things out of clay and copying artifacts. Check it out. These are not fired. They're not ready. This is just in its dry state. Uh, it's going to be decorated and everything. But this is a copy of an artifact. Of course, I was supposed to make it a little fatter, but, you know, I'm still learning. I just started doing this in August uh, last month. But check it out. It's an ocarina. There's the underside. The sound hole's there. And it's a little fat horn toad lizard. Very beautiful sound we got. And I want to thank the lady that helps me out. I took a ceramics class just so I can learn the mechanics of, you know, how it dries and how long it takes to cure and, you know, when I'm supposed to do something or not. Um, otherwise, shaping things, no problem for me. But here you go. It's really cool. This is a tlapizali, what they call a clay flute. The ocarina is called Huila Capizli, and that's in the Nahuatl language, not Nahuatl, it's Nahuatl. Here you go. These are very high and loud. I'm gonna get far away. Of course, I'm still learning. Like I said, I'm not an expert at this. Then um, this is one that I fired, and then I make a lot of natural pigment paints. So uh, this is red hematite right here, and this is yellow oxide and uh, white titanium, and that's the color of the clay. So this is a tlapizali shaped like a flower, and that's real common for our flutes in ancient Mexico. But I love the tone of this one. Check him out. Beautiful. Anyway, there you go. Hopefully I'll do more.